<laughs> what up, folks? I'm UltraZone. Today, a review of the Fortnite Victory Royale series from Hasbro. Raptor Orange, Raptor Yellow. That's right, my little meat and chicken. Yum, yum. Um, with some really nice artwork here on the front. Uh, they look really, really good. And this is my first experience uh, with the Hasbro uh, Collector Friendly Victory Royale series. I had previously picked up a bunch of stuff from uh, the Jazzwares, uh, you know, Legendary series. Uh, and they were pretty good. Um, but I haven't bought anything here. I have been tempted. I'm not a Fortnite guy, but I like the designs a lot. Um, but raptors, okay, you got me. Oh, especially like cartoony looking raptors like this. Yeah, that looks pretty cool. It does. So I definitely had to check these guys out. This box came a little bit beat up. I got them on Amazon and oddly, I uh, had pre-ordered these guys and my pre-order still hadn't shipped yet. It said it could be anytime till August 30th, but they appeared in stock there. So I canceled my pre-order and reordered them and they shipped right away. So I don't get it. <laughs> this has happened to me many times before. I like say Walmart, but never on Amazon from my recollection. But that's neither here nor there. Here we got some cartoony raptors to look at. So without any further ado, let's get to the review. And here are the raptors out of the package. <laughs> They're really fun, guys. But first, let's look at their accessories because they both come with one. Uh, orange? Is it more red? It's like a red orange. Uh, he comes with, it comes, she comes, whatever, I don't care. Uh, with some meat. Comes with meat. Meat on the bone. And it looks good. Meat on the bone. Yep. It's meat on the bone. I can put it in his mouth or in its hand. And you'll see that, you know, towards the end there. But it's meat on the bone. And yellow comes with chicken. Yes, it does. It comes with a whole chicken. Um, just, you know, chilling chicken. A chilling chicken. Look at that head sculpt. <laughs> the whole sculpt is fun. Um, it, it's just fun, guys. A couple little scratches on it, but it's not bad. It's, it's fun. I mean, it's a chicken accessory, and um, I like it. I do. It's a nice little sculpt. It's a fun sculpt. They're gonna have a lot of fun with this little guy for sure. So if you were thinking Hasbro, good articulation, because this line, you know, is one of their quote-unquote collector's lines. Ah, uh, you were kind of wrong on that. Sorry to disappoint you. You do have uh, leg swivels. The tail does not move, except there is a bendy wire, from what I could tell. But it's not giving you a ton of movement, and it's more for uh, it's more of a prop to help stand it stand up. So the legs are on swivels; they do not go outwards at all or anything. The arms do have a hinge, and you can swivel them, and that is it. Uh, the neck does have a nice joint; it could go forward and back, and then the head. You know, you can move around, which is good. And uh, obviously you can open the jaw. So it's not really a ton of articulation. It's kind of on par with uh, like Mattel's line of figures. And, uh, you know, I, I didn't have any of, um, of the Hasbro <laughs> Jurassic line. Uh, at all. So I know that, you know, questions have come up with the Spider Rex, which we'll, you'll see here a little bit later in, um, you know, the opening of the Final Thoughts. Um, not Final Thoughts, but whatever thing we do. Size comparisons, yeah. Um, which is actually the first shot that I've shot here at my new location. So, um, you know, just keep that in mind. Uh, but anywho, you know, it was good to get those Hasbros together uh, because there was some questions about it. But anywho, that's the articulations on these guys. It isn't much. But let's take a look at these guys in full, starting with uh, red orange here. It's got pink feathers and they look cool. Nicely sculpted. 
You got it over here as well. They are a soft plastic. So, you know, there's that. But, you know, they look good. You see the skin is uh, done in a green. So, uh, that looks pretty good. Nice scaling on the skin throughout. You got this design back here. I don't know anything about Fortnite, so I don't know if the design mean much. Um, don't really care. It looks cool. And light blue. I, I think it's fine. Uh, and then you get the red orange. It's really mostly red, guys. Uh, on the bottom here and at the legs. The legs are nicely sculpted. The tail is, is decent as well. Although it has this big box here. And I have no idea what that's about. Um, but there is a big box there. Um, I like how the legs look. I like how the claws look. Claws look really good, actually. Um, very, very nicely done. So that looks pretty good. Yeah. Yeah. The arms here look pretty good. You got no paint at the nails uh, on the hands. They could have done that, I think. I think they could have. Unless there is no paint on the nails on the, <laughs> the game. But uh, it looks pretty good. And then you got this like lime green up here, which looks pretty cool. It's got this little sculpt there. I'm not sure what that is, but it is there. The head sculpt is where this shines, though. I really like it. I love his orange eyes. They look pretty good. Not bad. The print of the pupil could eh, leave a little bit to be desired, but it's all right. Uh, and then you get the red orange around here. I'm just gonna call it red orange because I said it's red orange. It's orange. Uh, the teeth look decent enough. You got some sort of pink showing. It's gums, right? Uh, but that's that pink. The tongue and the snooey parts in there. I like it. He's goofy. <laughs> These guys are so goofy looking, and that's the point, and that's why I like them. Um, I think they look really good, guys. It's fun. It's fun, and they pop. You know what I'm saying? They really do. And yellow here, for some reason, is even more goofy. He's got light yellow uh, feathers, and they look good. And then you got the yellow down here at the legs. The claws look fine. Um, the tail, and then you got this blue again. It's you know, kind of tealish, I guess. I don't know, light blue. Looks good. Looks pretty good. And then you got the green again here. It, it's the same figure, you know. It's not like anything's different here. It's just the colors. Um, I like the green. I do. I think it's pretty cool. Anybody, anybody can tell me about that little piece of scarring or whatever it is. It looks pretty interesting. I'd like to know more. Again, the skin scaling on these guys was really, really good. Very, very, very nicely done. I do think it's cool. Works well. You know, and head sculpts are awesome. Oh, I'm sorry. I knocked the other one down, but head sculpts are great. Orange, black looks good. Teeth look good here. The tongue and the sinewies look nice. I don't know. I like them. I do. I think they're fun. They're really fun figures. Um... You know, uh, I do, I, I like him better than that Spider-Rex. Uh, I'm going back to that one again because, you know, that was the other goofy, like, dinosaur thing I reviewed recently from uh, Hasbro. So, um, but you can see that there's more, like, a like a higher level of detail here. It's, you know, because it's in the Victory Royale line, it's a little bit more. And I'm just noticing there's a little sculpt thing there. I don't know what that's about, but... Um, it just could be like, you know, folds, of, you know, folds and wrinkles on dinosaurs, but you know what I'm saying. Uh, wrinkles, yes. Uh, but yeah, other goofy dinosaur and, uh, I don't know, I like these guys better. They, they feel substantial. There's, there's a nice weight to them. And, uh, I don't know, this, they're, they're just really fun. You got the chicken. You gotta love, gotta love the chicken and the meat. Ooh, knock down the chicken with the meat. But I like these guys, they're fun. And for a little trivia in my first scene from uh, my new review spot, here is uh, the Raptors uh, <laughs> with the Spider-Rex who's actually going away. So it's also his final uh, scene here at Ultrazilla Toys. So wish him well on his travels. You might see him on another channel soon. And for some more size comparisons, here are the Fortnite Raptors with a bunch of other Raptors you might have in your collection. And my final thoughts, 
uh, I just, I, I really like them. I do, you know, they're not super articulated, uh, but they have enough of articulation, you know, they're good enough. Um, I, I just think they're fun. They're really nicely sculpted and the paint just pops. Is it perfect? No, but is it fun? Yes, I don't know, I just dig them. I really do. They're just fun looking, funny looking uh, Raptors and I just love their accessories. Their two single accessories are just home runs in my opinion. Meat and a chicken. I can't go wrong with that. <laughs> so I had to get them. I had to get them and I'm glad I like them because they're, um, is that where it is coming again? Fun. So there you go, that's my review. Hope you dug it. Let me know your thoughts down below. And if you please like, comment, subscribe, share, check me out on Facebook and Instagram. Stay safe, till next time. Peace out, peace.